Hello, sausage. This is Nana Beryl, and today we're playing The Sims 2. Yes, now last time we left here, she had an expression on her face like she'd been drinking commercial car cleaner, didn't you, love? And nothing's changed since then, has it, dear? No, it hasn't. And here's Miss Medical, Miss Adventure. Oh, and it's Toby. Hello, Toby. He's been shaking his little gay rainbow ass outside for all the gay boys, haven't you, love? Because it's Pride Month. Yes, you have. You've been showing off your cake. And now he's having shaking of hands with a polka dotted drag queen. And she wants to talk to Miss Medical Adventure about this year's drag con and travelling there. Yes, and she thinks, well, I wonder if it will be held in a skyscraper like last year, love. And they have a good giggle about drag con and how good it was last year. They're just running through remembering what happened. Yes, that's right, love. And Regina Regina's sucking on the bubble machine. Oh, and look, it's Brianka Del Moro, who likes Moro bars. What are you doing, love? And she says, I'm choosing a soda from the soda machine. What does it look like, Nana Beryl? And over here, oh, look, it's, it's Brianka Del Rio. I mean, Bianca Del Rio, I mean. Isn't she looking gorgeous on that billboard? Yes, she is. And look over here, love, at Nana Beryl's little pride flag that I put on the footpath, darling. Yes, I have my little footpath pride sign. Yes, and I've been building a JB Hi-Fi as well, which, for those of you that don't know, it's an Australian electronic store that sells whiteware and other things as well, love. It also sells Blu-ray DVDs, and they sell fridges and televisions and computers and all sorts of They're a very good shop, they are. Yes, they're amazing. And what do we have over here, love? Shall we go and have another look at Brianka? I think we might have to, darling, yes. But before we do that, we might go over here and look at the carnival equipment that someone built, and also Burger King. Yes, now I've called it Burger King, but in Australia it's known as Hungry Jacks, because when they went to open it in the 1970s in Australia, there was already another business that was registered under the name Burger King. So Australia, I think, is the only place in the world where it's known as, where it's known as um, Hungry Jacks instead, love. That's right. So I've made it Burger King though, because most places in the world call it Burger King, dear, yes. And what are you drinking, Brianka? Are you drinking a Dr. Pepper's? And she says, no, Nana Beryl, I'm drinking a Coke Zero. Mm -hmm. Yes, she is. And over here we have the staff workers who have just arrived for Burger King. Yes, and they're a bit late. Yes, they're going to get in trouble, aren't they? They're on the clock and you might get your wages, Doc. Yes, you might. Now you need to come in here, Brianka, you do, and you need to check out the sewing machines and try and get a job as a seamstress. With licorice black, yes, that's right. You need to come in here, love. Look at the sewing machines, dear. Yes. So there she goes. She's checking out the place, darling. Yes, she's having a look. She might get a job there as a seamstress. She's just going to have a look at the sewing machines. Now, the sewing machines are called Simminger sewing machines, not Singer, love. That's right, Simminger sewing machines. Try and say that three times without your denture and he's a sausage. She doesn't like that machine, it's not very good. She thinks it's broken, yes, she thinks it's a little bit broken. Try the other one then, sausage. All right, love, stop loitering, go and have a look at the other one, that's right. And she's trying to thread a bobbin, but it's not working, love, yes. She thinks it must be switched off at the wall, yes. Either that or it's just broken, love, yes. Not quite as good as Singer sewing machines, are they, love? No, not quite as good as Singer. But they still did a very good job, whoever made them, love. They're very nice, aren't they, dear? Yes, you did a very good job, whoever made those for this, but from Mod The Sims. That's where I got them from, love. Yes, you did a very good job. Very creative, dear. You should be working for EA Games, yes. Now, she's going to change out of her dress because she's sick of looking like the Belle from Big Ben. Yes, that's right. She said it's not appropriate where she is right now. So she's going to change into some more normal clothing. Yes, she wants to wear something very normal which is why she's going to change into her star-spangled clothing, isn't that right, love? Yes, oh, there she is in the bathroom, isn't she? Oh, she's holding up the cubicles, they're all full, are they, love? Having to wait outside. Don't burst your bladder, darling. Oh my God, love, look at you, you look amazing, yes you do. I love your star-spangled boots, love, yes. You're almost like Wonder Woman, but without your tiara or bulletproof bracelets or lasso. So not like Wonder Woman has all been my love, we know, no, not really. Oh, and now she's going to get another drink. Are you going to get a Dr. Pepper's this time, love? And she says, don't let her barrel, I've got a Diet Pepsi. 
get it right, girlfriend, she says. And look at that advert for RuPaul every Friday night on Sinville's TV4. Look at it, love. Oh, it's RuPaul's Drag Race. So you even get RuPaul's Drag Race in Sindel. Oh, and look at the staff workers at Burger King. They're looking for their cardboard boxes. Yes, someone's run off with them. And oh, look, it's Hunky Muppet. What are you being doing, love? He says, I've been shaking my little gay rainbow ass at Burger King for all the gay boys for Pride Month. He's very nice, love. Now you need to go in here and have a look at the shop, Frianka. Yes, you do. Put your can down. That's right, love. I'll clean it up for you. And you need to go inside and have a look and do some shopping. Yes, you do. Oh, look at it, love. Yes. Now go inside and look at the dresses, darling. We don't want to look at the shelf, darling. Look at the dresses. You need something for drag con, something glamorous. You want to be a special queen. Yes, you do. Oh, so she went outside. Now she's back in there. What are you doing, love? She's buying a dress. Yes, she is. She's dry buying a dress for drag con. I don't know about the black one, love. It might not suit your red hair. How about we try something different? What about this one? Oh, that's quite nice, dear, but I don't know if I like the blue. Oh, maybe we'll try something else, like this. Oh, no, that's a Harry Potter costume, isn't it, love? It's what Hermione wears. You're not Hermione, are you, darling? No, you're not. I need to give you something glamorous for the catwalk sausage. Yes, what have we got here, love? Oh, he's got some nice dresses, lot of a selection, isn't he? Quite a big selection. Maybe we should try a yellow one on your or orange one. Or red, that's nice, I quite like that, love. What about this one? Oh, no, I think, I think we'll choose the red. Yes, that one there, love. Oh, very nice. Yes, you're going to look amazing at drag con, aren't you, dear? That's right, sausage. Here we go. You're going to buy that with your Amex, aren't you, love? And she says, no, Nana Beryl, it's American Express. Get it right. Yes, so now you're going to go shopping for something else, aren't you, love? I think you should look over here, dear. Yes, you should have a look at the jewellery. She says, no, Nana Beryl, I want to talk to the, the man with the big shoes and no nose who's wearing a plastic wig. So that's what she's doing, love. She's talking to the man with no nose with a plastic wig. Now what are you doing, love? She says, I'm going to go on the carousel, Nana Beryl. Yes, I'm going to go on the carousel and I want you to take a photograph of me. Are you really, love? Because yes, I am. I'm going to go on the carousel. See Nana Beryl now. Take a photo. And she's saying, hello, Nana Beryl. Take a photograph of me. But I can't, love, because my, my new digital camera has got a lithium battery and it's still charging. So I'm sorry. You're a bit out of luck today. She goes, Nana Beryl, take a photograph. Love, I think you're going deaf, darling. I think you need to see an audiologist. I've just told you my lithium battery is still charging, darling. So I think we'll have to go elsewhere because she's a bit deaf. Yeah, she's not hearing me. Yes, I, I know, love, you're not waving. That's right, darling, it's a bit much. Oh, and look, love, what do we have here? We have Gino Birch's lounge bar, don't we, love? Yes, we do. Isn't it stunning, love? Look at it. Oh, and look at that photograph of her. Isn't she looking stunning? Yes, she is. Now, for those of you who don't know who Gino Birch is, love, have you been living in a wardrobe? I think you have, darling. I think you've been living in a wardrobe. Either that or you're spending too much time in your pantry. You do realise that when you eat chocolate, you don't have to stay inside the pantry, love. You can come out of it, darling. Yes, you can. Now, even though I know you probably think your ISP doesn't provide enough bandwidth to stream such a high level of stunningness over it, you're wrong. Yes, and to prove you're wrong, I've actually put a link in the description below to Gino Birch's official YouTube channel. So you can go and test it out for yourself, love, yes you can, in the description below. Someone's been spiking the sherry with the helium, haven't you, darling? Yes, I think you have, bub. Oh, and look, she's showing off her overwhelming womanliness. Yes, she is. I think you need to turn that dial of womanliness down a little bit, love. You're floating in the air, darling. It's on too strong, yes it is. Oh, and what have we got here? We've got a nana, haven't we? Where is she, love? Where is she? Oh, get past the vending machine, Nana Beryl, where are we? Oh, there she is, Nana Downs. And she's dressed up like Gino Birch, love. She's hoping to be noticed. But I'm sorry, love, you're not using Kryolan grease paint and you're not using Trixie Cosmetics, darling. And those glasses are a bit cheap. Yes, I'm sorry, you just don't pass. So she's going home because she's not very happy about the insults I'm giving her. So she's gone home to play Cluedo with Mrs. Scarlet in the lounge with the dagger. That's right, love. Oh, and look, it's Madonna. What are you doing, Madonna? She says, I'm going home. I was going to stay here, but I'm too busy. I've been called in for an emergency choreography dance. So she's going to practice for her next tour. Yes, she is, because she's busy. Yes, she's very busy. She's always busy. And what are you doing, love? She says, I'm going to JB Hi-Fi because I need to buy something. Yes, she's going to purchase something, I think, love. 
Yes, she said, I am Nana Beryl. I'm going to purchase a Sims game. Yes, I'm going to purchase the Sims 3. Yes, I am. Because you can still get it on disc at here. Yes, you can. She's getting it on disc. See, they still have it on disc. Oh, my God. So she's going to purchase that. And she's also going to purchase House of the Dragon on Blu-ray DVD because they don't hear it in Simville. And she can't miss House of the Dragon. Oh, now, where are you going, Juno? And she says, well, I'm going to Burger King. I've got shopping to do. Shopping? And she says, yes, well, I'm going to go and do some shopping. She's going to buy some orange juice. You do realise this is not Cole's supermarket or Woolworth sausage. She says, I don't care. I don't have time to shop afterwards. Everything will be closed. So she's going to do a special deal with him and buy some orange juice. And then she wants a hamburger and some coffee. Don't you love? Yes, you do. So she's going to go and get a hamburger and some coffee. She says, I like a coffee, love. But I also would like a little bit of whiskey at it, darling. Be a bit naughty. And over here we have Ronald Grant, yes, now he's finished dealing with Miss Big Boobs in the court case, yes, but now he's decided he's found another one he likes, yes, he likes this one because she's got special cake, yes, he likes that cake, he thinks I would buy your cake, love, yes, he's falling in love with her cake, aren't you dear, yes, you are. He quite likes her, he likes more than just her cake too, don't you dear, yes you do. Oh, where are you love, where have you gone, oh you're over here love, that's right, so I'll just straighten up the camera angle. Yes, he's in love with her, he's asking her to call him. Oh, he's got to give her his telephone number, and she smells money. And she says, well, if you pay me enough, you can always, you can always put it down as a business expense, love. And over here we've got this waiter talking about Juno's tour, he's asking her when she's next on tour. And she says, well, love, I'm a bit busy with things at the moment. I'm starring in a television program, and I'm also drinking my whiskey-infused coffee, so just leave me alone and go and make me a burger, love. That's right, so she's waiting for her burger to arrive while she's drinking her whiskey-infused coffee. And now she's got another one. She had a secret stash that she hid under the table. Yes, that's right, she bought it in with her... I don't know where you hit it, but anyway. Oh, and here he comes with her burger. And she's ordered a Whopper Junior with cheese, haven't you, love? Yes. But she hasn't got her hash bites. They haven't given her hash bites, have they, love? No, they've forgotten. Have you got your hash bites? No, you haven't. You've just got a Whopper Junior with cheese, haven't you, darling? Yes. And she's really enjoying her Whopper Junior, aren't you, dear? Yes, you are. You're very excited about that. And look at her shirt, love. Drag queens matter. Yes, because they do, darling. Oh, and look, it's licorice hat. And she's blowing bubbles, yes. And there's her pussy. There's her pussy cat sitting up there on the chair by the lava lamps. Oh, and look, it's a dog that looks like it swallowed its own nose. And he wants to watch Bette Midler and For the Boys. But it's not on television at the moment, love. He also likes Bette Midler and Hocus Pocus and Ruthless People. Yes, he does, love. And now he's sniffing licorice's pussy. How dare you sniff licorice's pussy? Get away from her pussy, dog. That's right, love. You're a naughty dog, then go away. Leave her pussy alone. That's right, dear. How dare you do that to her pussy? Yes, now her pussy doesn't like that. He's angry, so he's going to mutilate and eat the chair. That's right, love. He's going to eat the bar stool. Oh, you're a naughty pussy cat. Yes, you are, love. You need some punishment. Oh, and he's still there, love. She's still waiting for me to take her photograph. Look at her. You need to get off there, love. You need an audiologist. She can't hear me, darling. She must be hard of hearing. You've got too much earwax in there, love. Nishti. Sur sur. Oh, love, you need to get off the carousel and go and have a go on the bouncy castle. That's right, love. Oh, that's right, love. Have a good jump on the bouncy castle. Oh, be careful, love. You nearly showed us all of your womanliness, didn't you, love? I think you need your legs a little bit closer together, dear. Yes, you do. Oh, don't give us another view of it, dear. I think we've seen too much already. Oh, be careful. You don't want the lightning to strike your underwire bra, love. Oh, we couldn't do that. You'll end up with five boobies. Oh, and look, love, he's talking about drag con again. Yes, he is about the dress he's going to wear. And they're having a good giggle about that, love, because his little gay rainbow ass can't wait to get inside a dress. Yes, that's right, dear. Oh, and look, she's having a good go sucking on that, um, on that bubble machine, isn't it, Regina, Regina? Yes, she is. And these two are going to tickle. Yes, they're going to tickle Dixie Cartel. Yes, they are. Oh, they're having a good time, aren't they? Love being very social. And look at the little twirly-whirly 60s tables, love. I put them in front of the chairs, but they're in the way, I think. Yes, I think you need to move those, dear. Oh, and look at you, look, Chris What are you doing? Oh, no, she's not there, love. 
Where is she? Where is she gone? Oh, and look, it's Miss Medical Misadventure. What are you doing, love? Oh, and look, it's B. Chav from the Chav family. She's there too. She's probably looking for her son. Yes, she is. And what, what is Miss Medical Adventure doing? She's going into Burger King. Hungry Jacks, yes she is. Are you going to order some food, Miss Medical Miss Adventure? I think she is. Isn't it a nice little Burger King, isn't it? Oh, I think I made quite a good job making this. Yes, I made this from scratch. Though one of the posters on the wall was a modification that someone's done of one of the posters in The Sims 2, love, yes. So it's a very good job, and I downloaded that from Mod The Sims, yes, I did. <clears throat> oh, and look, isn't that a nice window with a picture of Juno behind it? I think it's quite nice, isn't it, dear? And what do we have inside? Do we go inside, love? Yes, I think we'll go back inside, dear. Now, someone desperately needs to move those chairs, sausage. Oh, and look, Sausage, it's Dixie Cartel, and she's changed back into her 1980s leg warmer. Yes, and she's in Nana Beryl's custom disco tech at the Haunted Match, and that's right, love. And yes, I did just say the word disco tech, love, yes, I did. And now I'm going to show you the Haunted Mansion with the roof up, love, yes, I am. Look at my custom-built little Haunted Mansion, yes, it has a little display museum. Yes, a little haunted things. And what we've got downstairs there. Oh, yes, we've got some lamps out there. Now, I didn't make those. Those were downloaded from Mod The Sims, the Halloween lamps at the front there, darling. Yes, that's right. Oh, and let's go back to the disco, shall we, love? To the little nightclub. Oh, and look, he's moving his little gay ass. Yes, he is. Oh, look at him, the little gay goblin. He's shaking his cake to bring all the boys to the yard, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. And he's going for it. Yes, he's like to show off that cake, darling. Oh, and I think you should join him, darling. Yes, look at her, love. Oh, is that dancing, dear? Oh, better be careful. Look at her go. I'm not sure if that's dancing or they're about to drop an 11-pounder, darling. Yes, you look like you're about to shot, drop an 11-pounder through your foo-foo clacker. Oh, and he's leaving. He's had enough. Yes, he's going away. He's got things to do. Oh, my God, love. Be careful, darling. We can't quite tell whether you're dancing or passing wind, dear. That's right, sausage. Be careful. We don't want you passing wind on the dance floor because when she passes wind, she passes wind with such power that usually she blows away her underpants. Yes, she does. Oh, and now she's happy with a bit prance around too again. Look at her. Oh, look at her go, love. Oh, you're looking amazing, aren't you, love? She's looking from side to side. Oh, my God, you should be a choreographer for Megan Trainer, love. Yes, you should, and Kylie Minogue. Could you show off her 1980s leap warmers? Now, what have we got here, love? Oh, Regina, Regina's been sucking on the helium. That's nice, love. Nice to catch up with what you're doing. But I think we'll cross over to Dixie again and look at her dance moves, love. Oh, my God, you're amazing. Look at you go, dear. Oh, that's not like you're dancing in the 1980s at all, love. No. Oh, and look, it's Licorice Hack, and she's coming in here. And there goes... Oh, and there's uh, the Vika. Yeah, that's right. It's Devoria the Vika. And she's in there, and she, she thinks that Licorice Hack is Licorice Black, and she really likes Licorice Black, and she also likes uh, Juno Birch, which is why she's got a Juno Birch top on, love, and she thinks she's Licorice Black, and she goes to give her a hug, saying, oh my god, it's Licorice Black, and she says, no, sorry, love, I'm Licorice Hack, not Licorice Black, love. And she's a bit disappointed in that, because she's going to ask you for her autograph. Now look at the Gino Birch picture on her top, love. Now it looks like a character cartoon, but it's not, love. It's just the gloves underneath. See, the, the gloves, the yellow gloves with the red fingernail polish, darling. It's just that it's a small picture, so it's hard to see, dear. Yes, it is. Now I think at a moment we might um, leave it there, dear, because this is going to be part two of maybe a three or four part episode, love. So this is part two. Now, probably going to upload um, several together at the same time, darling. Yes, so we'll leave it there. Now, thank you so much for watching. And tune in the next, next time for Nana Beryl's next exciting video. Thank you for watching, Sausage. Bye-bye.